Hey everybody, hope you're all good. Oh yeah, so um, we just watched the Super Bowl halftime show. Dude. Um, really haven't paid any attention to the game itself, but the halftime show. Um, it was Shakira and J Lo. Yeah, no, it was, it was, it was really cool. Very nostalgic, heavy too, cause like we grew up with with these artists. And everything like I remember J Lo and I remember when Shakira, you know, first happened and stuff like that. And yeah, and you're more like I I don't how to how to put you, but I don't know. You you definitely pay more attention to what's top forties, what's trending. Like sometimes <laughs> because depends. Shakira Shakira's one of those artists <laughs> and J Lo as well, who does tons of music internationally. Yeah. Like They've got millions of hits, like... Yeah, like, like, I don't, like, I'm not, I'm not, like, I'm not, I like, I like some modern music, but really, it, it kind of just depends, um, and sometimes, like, because sometimes if, like, some of my artists that were my favorites, like, again, Shakira, and I hear them on the radio But you often, know the songs that were top 40 hits. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, but, um, no, it was, it was dope, because there was, like... <laughs> It was your it was your standard Super Bowl show. Um, I will say, earn that paycheck, ladies. Yes. Like, oh my, oh my fucking goodness. goodness, earn that paycheck. It was so cool, and J Lo. Oh my god, like I was reliving like a lot of my like childhood scene with with all your dances and stuff like that. I was like, oh my god, I remember that. It's and, like Jenny still got it. Yes, yes Daddy she does. Still got it. So you ladies both looked beautiful. <coughs> I loved your outfits. It was like a cool sort of like like neo swing. No. Like no. flapperish almost. Um you know what? Congratulations. That was a ballsy ass move. I don't know how the fuck you got that approved. Yes. But <laughs> that that born in America, born in the USA with the Puerto Oregon. Rican flag. Yes. Um uh, that was beautiful. That was fucking beautiful. That I, I was, love it. Yes, no, that was amazing. That was, when we saw it, it was really cool. Like, no, for real. That moment brought tears to my eyes. Like, it, 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 brought, it brought so much, like, pride and respect. Like. Yeah. I, I enjoyed that moment. Um, I don't know. I'm I'm not really invested in the actual Super Bowl itself. Neither I'm never really I, into sports, to be honest. It, it's not my thing. Well, I don't I don't really pay attention to American sports anymore, less and less. And I mean, I don't know. I just sports have never really interested me as a kid, and like my parents weren't really into it, so I I wasn't like really. You know, not that my parents didn't like sports, and you know they encouraged me, and my sister, to play sports. Like I, I did softball yeah, for no, a amount and, of years. And playing sports is totally different than watching sports. Yeah, you know, but like, it, it's the whole thing of just like. It's like the only sports that I'm kind of into is, is world football, soccer. Soccer, yeah. Yeah, because it's, it's football every other country except for America. I like soccer because, like, uh, like football because it's like, it's. Um, I don't know. Fuck. I have, sorry, I lost English my football has this real like tribal sense. Yeah, the, that's, what, that's real, what I like, like about it. This this team is represents my neighborhood. This is my area, and yeah, there's definitely some of that when it comes to like state teams, um, college teams, college teams. Yeah, um, when it comes to teams in general. I don't really give a fuck about American teams. I want to start following our football team, but it's just, they don't broadcast anywhere. It's like, it's so hard to catch their games. Yeah. So it's like, I can't really follow. Yeah, I could follow on Yahoo Sports, but I don't know. So yeah, English football, I just can't watch right now. I catch a game every now and then on NBC. Yeah, I mean, I I don't really watch it myself. There are, I mean, I mean if it's on, I'll, I'll I'll get into it, because football football like like world football is a lot more exciting. Yeah, it's so much more action. There there's 
It's like it's like land hockey because well, they'll still kick the shit out of each other. No, too. the issue is when most American sports to me or for me, it's just all the start and stop. It's just all the start and stop. And football, it's like I don't know. All your ads are around the stadium and it's just forty five minutes of gameplay, half time. You know, you you talk with some journalists or the reporters about the goings ons of this game, and you're back to the game, and you're done. Another forty five minutes. It's like, it's like, that's it. Oh man. Very rarely is there stoppage. We have a soccer team in Minnesota. Yes, we do. And it sucks. I don't. I mean, it's just hard to find their games, like the Boston game. I went to no. I went to a a Minnesota Thunder soccer game, and when I was a camp counselor, and it was a very boring game. No one won. They tied. It was zero zero. <laughs> oh no! It no, was no. such a bad game. The, the Thunder isn't our football team anymore. They're not. The, the Thunder disbanded a long time ago. Well, no wonder why they're we, not that we good. We have in, in United, Minnesota United. Oh, we have Minnesota United now. Yes, I didn't we, know we that. We have a United team. I didn't know that. Yes, yes. Well, I hope United's a lot better than the Thunder. They are actually. And... Okay, good. <laughs> 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 no, the game was just like super boring because like no one scored but yeah as far as my investment in this game is that i'm from missouri go chiefs <laughs> i don't know like i hope That's your as team deep wins. as my investment goes i guess i hope your team wins me but the thing is like i'm from minnesota where like the vikings are choke artists who disappoint year after year yeah that's essentially it you choke vikings you choke <laughs> Like, seriously, it's so fucking annoying. I'm really pissed off you have that fucking new stadium. You don't fucking deserve it, motherfuckers. You really don't. Like, seriously. At least the Twins have been to, like, a World Series from the 90s and got really close that one year. They do better than them. I don't know. The Twins do good. I, I, I can't remember the last time the Twins made it to the playoffs. The Vikings don't deserve it, though. You don't. I'm sorry, you don't. And you haven't even paid it back. I mean, I feel like most Minnesota teams are subpar. So before you say anything, the Wild is I will isn't say horrible. I have a lot of hope and faith with the Minnesota Rocker. They're our esports team. Minnesota Rocker, actually, yes. I am a fan of you guys. You're actually I, pretty good. I, I've I've heard good things. Yes. You know, and you've gotten really close in some aspects, but you're still starting. Yes, <sighs> they're a fresh faced team, and I definitely support Minnesota. Please, Rocker. like, please, you have no idea how much of like a tech nerd this the state is in general. You have to do good. This is where Minnesota actually does pretty well at, in general. You know. Yeah. No. Oh. Uh... So, is, is, is being Super Bowl, the commercials are interesting. Um, I'm kind of excited for a new show on Fox. It's a new competition show. It is competition Lego building. Yes! <laughs> Master Builder. That I am Fox. so excited for. Yes. I am so going to watch that show. I am going to watch that. <laughs> watch the shit out of that show. <sighs> oh my goodness. Yeah, so I think good job, J-Lo. Good job, Shakira. Yes, that, you know, really beautiful. This is going to be definitely one of those performances that's going to be, like, in, like, the top ten. It's going to be talked about. Yeah. This is going to be talked about. Yeah, it's, the like, Born it's, in like, America, Puerto Rico flag. Yeah, no, like, this is, like, as good, oh, like, just... As good as the Prince performance. Because Prince, I always say, gave the best Super Bowl performance. I think this is really close to that. Yeah. If not, like, level to it. Yeah, no, I think this might... I, mean, I remember the Prince one. That was a great one. Yeah, this it is... It rained, and when it sang, when he sung Purple Rain, it was so cool. Watch it. I recommend you guys watching that show. It's probably one of his best performances I'd ever seen. 
But yeah, I think um, it's a good, good show, good job, good place to wrap up. Um, like, comment, subscribe. Yes. If you haven't yet, there's a new episode of the podcast up with Admiral Fox. Yep, and we will have a new episode up soon. Yes, yes, soon, soon. So, talk to you guys later. Peace.